Good afternoon and welcome to the 2016 NCAA Division II Women's Basketball Championship Quarterfinal Press Conference. We're joined by the Bentley Falcons. Uh, they were 53-52 winners over Virginia Union in the quarterfinal matchup here. They'll advance to Wednesday night's 6 p.m. matchup against Lubbock Christian. Uh, they improved to 29-5 and five on the season and this was Coach Stevens' 800th career win at Bentley University today. So congratulations to you, Coach. Um, we'll open it up with a opening statement about the game from you, Coach. I, as I said in the locker room, I really don't know what to say. Um, it, was a, uh, it was a game that I felt um, we dictated at the defensive end. Um, I, I think that we rebounded the ball extremely well, which is certainly one of their strengths. Um, I felt as though it, we, we knew we could not stop Kiana Johnson, but we wanted to try to do our best to contain her, maybe limit her good looks at the basket. Uh, but I will admit when the ball was in her hands with four seconds left, I was a little nervous about that. Um, but all along this team has, um, we've been down in a lot of games this year and we've come back. And we've, we've probably had more close games than we've had uh, well, I don't think we've had a blowout, to be honest with you. We haven't had a game where I could relax, not for one second. So uh, we're used to this, and um, I think that our team handled uh, most of the situations towards the end of the game pretty well. Um, defensively, I, I, uh, I mean, I, I couldn't have asked for anything more from them. Uh, offensively, we made timely shots. We went a little dry um, in the second half, but again, timely shots at, at the right time. Thank you. We'll now open it up for questions from the media for student athletes Jen Gemma, Jane White, and Victoria Lux, along with Coach Stevens. Please state your name and association <laughs> uh, prior to asking questions. So we'll open up to the media. Matt. I think in an earlier interview this season, I was asked to describe our team in one word, and I said gritty. And I think that um, that has a lot to do with what we did in the second half. We saw what happened in the first half with number three having 16 points, um, and we realized that we had to step up in all aspects. So I think that we really just dug in, um, did what we needed to do, followed our game plan, and we got huge rebounds at very important times. Um, and we worked together. That's another thing. We talked. If we got in trouble, we communicated about it. Um, I think that's really what helped us out in the end. Other questions? Coach, can you talk about that last possession underneath the basket? Uh, what play was called and kind of what happened? Can you under, can you the one that we threw away, you mean, that one? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> um, as I, I just wanted to say one thing. I, I just saw that we had 21 turnovers, which um, it didn't help our cause by any means, but um, uh, that was another one that um, was certainly uh, uh, not what we wanted at that particular time either. But again, uh, fortunately, we got the stop. But, I, but I'll say this about what we were hoping in terms of a game plan. Um, you know, I, I really thought that if the game was in the 70s, we would have a good shot to win. Um, if the game was in the 60s, I was I would be elated. I would really think that you know we would have a shot. But the game was in the 50s, which was um, more than we could ask for. And I think that's um, you know the fact that we kept them down in terms of their scoring, um, you know, did a better job I think in the second half of. of Limiting, I mean, I'm seeing three double-figure scores, but I don't see much from anybody else. And, and I, again, I, I want to compliment our players for just a great defensive uh, job that they did. Yeah, 67 points was their lowest uh, point total the season prior to today's yeah. uh, 52. Uh, more questions, Matt? Our game plan was there, I mean, they transitioned like crazy. So we were going to maximize every possession. <coughs> and I think we did a good job of that in the first quarter. Um, but I think as the game went on, their defense picked up and just like a natural response. We kind of picked up our offense too, made some careless mistakes. But um, 
as Coach just said, our defensive, um, the work on the defensive end helped us. Questions? All right, best of luck to you guys tomorrow night at 6 o'clock versus Lubbock Christian. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.